Hi, this is Sherry. Now you're going to have to forgive me. I am not a video guru and I don't know how to make slick videos and all of that. So I just do the best I can in the way of trying to get information out. One of the things I've noticed, um, even though I might not have written about Bayou Corn for a while in Subsection, uh, Louisiana, um, I've been watching it. And I've noticed that there's not been a single new video, flyover video, since December 27th, 2012. Um, and I go to the site a lot. And they'll have information about what Texas Brine is doing and all of that. But there's been no flyover. What I wanted to do, because I'd been noticing this, the last flyovers, I watched for it. The ones, you know, you can see it. So, I have a few of the videos up here, and I'm going to be just tabbing between them, because I, I want to point out some things. First of all, this is from the uh, October the 11th flyover, okay? Here's the thing that I've been watching a lot, and it's this building back there, all right? Now, that building right now, you can see that it is dry. You see how you can see green? It's dry around there. All right. Now, you see, of course, how sinkhole, how big it is at that time, where well, you can still see some green. It was starting to take over those pipelines, and since then, it's, of course, totally taken over the pipelines. Now, I'm going to go forward a little bit. All right. Now, watch. This is the area where those buildings are, which... I've been watching. You can see a little bit of the water that had gone up there, right? Now, let's go to November 1st. Here's November 1st, 2012. All right, I stopped it already where you can see that it's green. There's a little bit of water coming over here. And then you see here it's all dry. There's some kind of a lake water thing there and then right here is highway 70 all right that goes through right by the sinkhole all right now one of the things that has been happening is a lot of earthquakes constantly so we're seeing the sinkhole here all right um you can see the, the flyover what they're doing all right so you see how green and it's dry there, pretty much. All right. Oops. Now, let's go to November 14. And this is not the best video. All right. This is shot. Here's Highway 70. Here's that lake situation thing that's close to the, the highway. Here's those buildings. And then here's the sinkhole. Okay. Now, you're starting to see there's a little bit of water that's starting to, you can see the water right there because the sinkhole uh, water has been coming all throughout this area. Um, and, all right, so here we see there's some water now starting to come over that way. All right, there's the sinkhole. Of course, it's taken over the pipelines. It's going over in this area now, too. Okay? So that's another whole um, storage area. All right. Now, let's go to December the 19th. Flyover. Look at how the water, which is what was green here. Let's go back a little bit. Okay. It's green there. Now, we're seeing, look at the water taking over that area, okay? It's up behind there, too, now, and now it's going all along there, all right? So, we're seeing, now look how close it is, oops, uh, this is the whole flyover, uh, let's go forward here, look how close it is to that lake, and now there's again Highway 70 that goes through, all right? And uh, they're not giving us much sinkhole, which is funny, considering that they only give us seconds. All right. Now you're seeing it's taking over that area. It's going farther. 
you can see they don't even have. They have to keep rebuilding that one little portion. All right. Now let's go to December, which is the last one they've done. This is the last flyover that's available. And it's it was huge then. It was just, look how they had the, uh, the lines. All right, trees are getting sparser. And this is the last flyover. What they don't show is any area back here, which is that building that I like to watch to see how much water is taking over. They're not showing that. And you can see they used to constantly build out that one little thing, and now they're hardly able to do it. Look how much more was taken in a short amount of time. And water's now going throughout that whole area. But here's the thing. Why are they not showing... Here's the some here's the uh, the website. They do have updated situation, the field update. I right, I'll have this linked, but they're not, and they'll say that they're monitoring. Um, you know, these are all the different things that's been been being done, and they'll say that they're monitoring uh, the seismic activity, which all the. Uh, Seismic activity is constant there. You can see some pretty big ones. That's a pretty big quake. And, you know, that, of course, doesn't ever show up. None of the seismic activity shows up on um, USGS. All right. That's right there at the uh, Bayou Corn Hole. All right. That was um, then yesterday's. Look at all the activity. Um, for some reason, one which would show constant activity is showing blank now. Let's go back a little bit. Ah, they have a little bit there. Let's go back to the 14th. They have some from the 14th. Either they're having a problem with it. Oh my gosh. Maybe that's why they're not showing it anymore. This is the one that has shown a lot, a lot of activity. That is the Bella Rose um, seismic uh, monitor. And that's the one I've noticed constant activity. Now, that was a huge amount of activity. And that was from the 14th, which now, for some reason, they don't have on anymore. Let's go to the 15th. Okay, they do have some on the 15th, a lot. But then once the 16th comes, nothing. And then once the 17th, no, nothing anymore. So they're not having that. Now, that's a weird line. Um, they're not having it on anymore. Bayou Corn, we can go back to the 14th. Again, they're having a, uh, where they're not showing much there. 16th, nothing. Come 17th, they are showing, and this is, of course, the Bayou Corn one. Uh, but all of these are right there next to it anyway. Okay. Um, this is a site, which I'll have linked, um, where you can see all the activity from the University of Memphis. And it has the different Bayou Corn, all of them that are right there by it. Okay. Um, now they have, this is a new one they put up. Holy smokes, that's a new one they just put up. That was not on there. That was just now the south of Highway 70, which is where, wow, I hadn't seen this one before. And then nothing, huh, today, compared to even going back, but oh my. That's huge. That is the one south. I'll show you which one I'm doing. South of right there. South of Highway Bella Rose. So you can go and see it yourself. Okay. Um, then here, let's just check this one out. 
it's pretty intense, the one below it. All right, so things are happening at Bayou Corn still, but they're not showing it um, anymore. They haven't done a flyover. They're not allowing embedding. I try to share embed. Uh, embedding is disabled now, so you can't uh, embed the, the videos, and that's kind of why I'm making this one. All right, that's the update or no update on uh, Bayou Corn. Again, look how green that is, and then we start getting to um, where it's not, and it's water taking over. All right, thank you, Sherry.